Mastering vocabulary. Mixing equipment, explained. Hello, everyone. Welcome to our English language learning series. Today, we're going to unravel the meaning and usage of the term mixing equipment. Whether you're a budding chef, a music enthusiast, or just curious about English, this video is crafted for you. Firstly, let's break down the term. The word mixing refers to the action of combining two or more substances or elements so that they become a single entity. It can be used in various contexts like cooking, music production, or even in industrial settings. The beauty of English is in its versatility, and mixing perfectly exemplifies this. Moving on to equipment. Equipment refers to the tools or machinery designed for a specific task. It's not just about having tools. It's about having the right tools for the job. Whether it's a spoon in your kitchen or a high-tech gadget in a laboratory, if it's made to help you accomplish a task, it's equipment. Now, let's combine the two. Mixing equipment refers to the tools or machinery specifically designed to mix ingredients or components. In a kitchen, this could be your handheld mixer. In a studio, it could be the audio mixer. And in an industrial plant, it could be a large machine mixing chemicals for production. The term adapts to the context, but the essence remains the same. They are tools made to mix. Let's put this into perspective with some real-life examples. In a bakery, a baker uses a dough mixer to combine flour, water, and yeast, making bread dough. In music production, a sound engineer uses an audio mixing console to balance and adjust different soundtracks. In construction, a cement mixer combines cement, water, sand, and gravel to form concrete. And that's a wrap on mixing equipment. It's fascinating how two simple words can encompass such a broad spectrum of tools and applications. We hope this video has enriched your understanding and vocabulary. Keep exploring, and remember, in the world of English, every word is a new adventure. Happy learning, and see you in the next video.